what's going on guys and welcome back to the carnivore only preserve we are here because we've got every single carnivore in the game though thus far carnivore piscivore and whatever omnivore i like to classify so oviraptor and gigantoraptor are on here but not say um what was it uh Dinochirus or Spinoceratops because I class them as more herbivores and whatever. So I might do something special for the herbivore only enclosure, but that's like later down the line. But anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to let everyone hunt down and combat each other so then we can see who the top apex predator is. So I will um, set everything up and I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, so I've raised the stakes a little bit just to see what goes on. All right, we got one of the T-Rexes that actually made its way over here. We've got the Spinosaurus. I think that was Little Edie. We got a Tarbosaurus over here. One of the Gigas is trying to square off with something. We got a fight between a Troodon and a Deinonychus over here. They're just duking it out. We got a fight between Megalosaurus and Changesaurus. A fight between Spinoraptor, or oh, sorry, Scorpius Rex and Cryolophosaurus. My bad. Yeah, the hyper-aggressive carnivores or the hyper-aggressive hybrids, I, I gave them negative traits. So what are your traits like? Short-lived, antisocial, aggressive, weak, and vulnerable. All right. All right, so that cryo, I think, will die. Yeah, the Scorpius Rex clearly lost that. We saw Indominus Rex and T-Rex. All right, we got Allosaurus and Spinoraptor, Ceratosaurus and Albertosaurus, Tarbosaurus and Giganotosaurus, Indoraptor and Pyroraptor. There's too much going on. I want to see this fight go down. All right, they're calling off their fight. Albertosaurus versus Dimetrodon. Oh, we got Allosaurus being attacked by Pyroraptors. We got a Gigantoraptor running in the distance. There's just way too much going on. I haven't gotten a chance to see the T Rex versus Indoraptor or Indominus Rex fight. Where is the Indominus? Oh no, it's still alive. 46% and it's about to fight something? A Monolophosaurus. You're going after something easy. It looks like the T-Rex did do a number on it. Yeah, that mono didn't last long. We got a Dilophosaurus killing a Coelophysis, it looks like. Utahraptor going up against a what was that, a Proceratosaurus? Yeah, Proceratosaurus. The two Changesaurus is duking it out. We got a Giganotosaurus and Tarbosaurus. Why is there so much going on? Well, probably because of all the carnivores, I would imagine. We got a Atrociraptor going up against Proceratosaurus. The Proceratosauruses are kind of dying left and right. We got a Herrerasaurus and a Dilophosaurus. Dimetrodon going up against a Atrociraptor. We got, what's that, Australovenator and Baryonyx? Indoraptor and Giganotosaurus. Oh, sorry, Gigantoraptor. What are your traits like? Nocturnal, aggressive, and vulnerable. I kind of forgot Gigantoraptors were a thing. We got 45% against 82%. 64%. So yeah, the Indoraptor definitely has the upper hand here. We'll have to see what goes on. Troodon versus Dilophosaurus. Cacarodonosaurus versus T-Rex. This is Little Edie. Alright. You got the first hit in. Alright, we're at 67%. What are your traits like? Fit and tolerant. And then your traits are resilient, nocturnal, tolerant, aggressive, and strong. So yeah, that'll explain it. Trodon killing a seal of physis. 
Uter Uterinus and Uterinus. Gigantoraptor and Spinoraptor. This should be interesting. Yeah, they're calling it off. 48% against 62%. Krylophosaurus versus Megalosaurus. We got so much carnage. I don't think the Spinosaurus has gotten into any fights yet. Oh, that Allosaurus just died to Atrociraptors. Two Metricanth... Oh, and a Metricanthosaurus and a Majungasaurus duking it out. Ceratosaurus versus Albertosaurus. Ceratosaurus just died to an Albertosaurus. There's just way too much going on. Asukamimus died to Atrociraptors. We got an Australovenator going up against a Baryonyx. An Atrociraptor hunting down a Sinoceropteryx, but that's expected. We got Indoraptor versus Gigantoraptor. 48% against 96. Yeah, I think the Gigantoraptor doesn't stand a chance. Is there a killing animation or... Well, the Gigantoraptor is still alive. So we'll have to see what happens here. It might retreat, or the Gigantoraptor might get a hit in. Yep, Gigantoraptor gets a hit in. Alright, cool, cool. They'll run, yep. They'll call off their fight. Or maybe you get another hit in. Oh no, that Gigantoraptor's dead. I'm just waiting to see if it'll spring back to the ground. Nope, it won't spring back up. Alright, cool. Alright, Indoraptor got a kill in. Alright, so so far we've got a dead Uterinus to a Megalosaurus. Some Monos died. We got another Allosaurus going up against a Gigantoraptor. Another Gigantoraptor just died. How many of these do we have left? The last living Gigantoraptor. Got another Dimetrodon and a Trosoraptor fight. We got, what's that, Giganotosaurus and Spinoraptor? Yeah, they're calling off their fight. Dua, get out of here. I'm trying to have some fun here. I think the other one's still alive. Yeah, the other one's still alive. You're just going after some food. Greg. There we go. We got Kakaradonosaurus killing the T-Rex. Little Edie is dead. Meanwhile, an Albertosaurus is fighting the other T-Rex. The Lost World T-Rex. So we only have one T-Rex left. They're calling off their fight. The other Kakaradonosaurus is fighting a Megalosaurus. Meanwhile, we got the Indominus Rex going after another Easy Pickings. The Monolophosaurus. And another model Monolophosaurus dying to an Albertosaurus. Dimetrodon versus a Trociraptor. We shouldn't have too many left. We have one, two. Oh, we only have two left. We got a Trociraptor hunting down a Sukamimus. That Sukamimus is gonna die. Yep, it's dead. Do we have any Sukamimus left? Or one? We got one that's sleeping. Alright, no, two of them are still alive. What about Garnet? He kind of he kind of has the colors of a Garnet. He's not quite a ruby. He's more of a Garnet. Yeah, that's what we'll go for. Garnet the Sukamimus. I'll probably have another OC to create at some point. Utahraptor and Atrociraptor. Troodon and Deinonychus. So, so already we've got a lot of uh, a lot of carnivores seem to gather around the middle area. We got a Dinonychus and Velociraptor. All right, Dinonychus just died. How many Velociraptors do we have left? One, two, three. Well, that one died. So three. We only have three Velociraptors left. We got Indoraptor going up against Pyroraptor. Pyroraptor's gonna die for sure. Oh, saying that. Saying that. 
He does fight back a little. What's this? Kakaradonosaurus against Spinosaurus? This is probably the Spinosaurus' first fight. I'm gonna... Alright, it's not letting me take a screenshot again. Ah, that kind of sucks. It's doing that thing again where if I try to press Alt to it, it doesn't do anything. Alright, we got a Kakaradonosaurus against Albertosaurus. 100% against 59%. We got two Gigantoraptors that are dead. Tarbosaurus just died to an Allosaurus. See, I missed a lot of this because... I... We got a Gigantoraptor. We got a Utahraptor killed by a Gigantoraptor. Indominus Rex going up against a Herrerasaurus. Just killed a Herrerasaurus. We got Greg getting attacked by Atrociraptors. It looks like. <laughs> looks like he did survive. And now he's gonna go lay down. I'd run after that, but whatever. We got a dinosaur that's been poisoned. Baryonyx going up against... Oh, okay, that disappeared before I could get to it. Crylophosaurus versus Dilophosaurus. But yep, that was not really much of a fight. Indoraptor going up against a Proceratosaurus. Oh. The Proceratosaurus does kind of fight back. 25% against 57%. Not looking good. Not looking good at all for this guy. We got, what's that? Tarbosaurus and Giganotosaurus. I kind of like that color for the Tarbo. Oh, the Tarbo actually won that fight. 68% against 42%. Indominus Rex going up against Carnotaurus. 42% against 83%. The Indominus is retreating. Carnotaurus won that fight. We got two Serratos. We still got two Serratos left. A Coelophysis hunting down one of the small carnivores, maybe either a a Compi. Oh, that was a that was a Segisaurus. Atrociraptor, I think hunting down an Allosaurus? Yeah, it looks like an Allosaurus. We got T-Rex versus Spinosaurus. I need to pause this. Go into capture mode. Get that. Yeah, that could be good. That'll be a great thumbnail. I'm gonna go with that. 69% against 100%. So it looks like the T-Rex got the first hit. They'll call this fight off without a doubt. They did a little dance. That must not be comfortable. The spine bending like that. That's probably not too comfortable for the Spinosaurus. It's called Spinosaurus because it's known for the spine. They just fought. Yeah, th that's definitely a fake out. We got a Uterenus and a Herrerasaurus duking it out. Alright, 5% against 100%. Not looking good for the Herrerasaurus. Though it does fight back a little. They'll call that fight off... Excuse me. We got an Atrociraptor hunting down a Sinusoropteryx. Troodon being killed by a Velociraptor. Tarbosaurus killing a Utahraptor. We've got such a huge traffic jam with the cars. Because that car is broken down. 
No, I don't want to go back to the station. I want to look at this. I think that car either broke down or the, the uh, Demetrodon's blocking it. Look at this. And they just keep coming. The cars just keep coming. It's actually hilarious. Oh, they're moving. The Demetrodon must have disappeared because they are moving. We've got Indominus Rex going up against Ceratosaurus. Oh! Ceratosaurus just killed Indominus Rex. That's awesome. Vehicle destroyed? Yeah, yeah, whatever. Emergency shutdown? No, no, don't do the emergency shutdown. Send Ranger. Ugh. Fine, I'll send a Ranger. No, I don't want to direct control it. We got a dead Utah Raptor over here that just got killed by Greg. Actually, I'm sensing some deja vu. When Axeman did a series on this, didn't he name this his Giganotosaurus Greg? I think he did. We got Garnet going up against Greg. This should be interesting. Greg does end up getting the first hit in. Alright. One, one hit each. You guys get to see a fight take place. Oh god. Yeah, Sukumimus is gonna retreat. Meanwhile, we've got Albertosaurus going up against T-Rex. 85% against 68%. Ceratosaurus and Carnotaurus going at it. Majungasaurus and Australovenator. We got Changasaurus versus Cryolophosaurus. Acro? We haven't seen Acro get into any fights. Have you been in any fights? You you had one loss. So you guys might call it off. Oh, no, never mind. Carno gets the first bite in. Alright. They have random traits, so you never know what's going to happen. Alright, Acro actually lost that fight. Carnotaurus. Good job, buddy. So what's the destruction like now? Is the Scorpius Rex dead? We haven't heard from the Scorpius Rex in a while. I think it's dead. There's the Indominus. Is... I think... Has the Scorpius died? Let's filter that to Carnivore. Yeah, it died. The Scorpius died. And so did the Indominus, which means the Indoraptor is the only one left. When it comes to hybrids. Up, oh, a Spinoraptor got in. A Spinoraptor got into the enclosure. You know what? We don't even need these anymore, so... We can just go ahead and delete these. Ceratosaurus and Carnotaurus. Ooh, Carnotaurus just died to a Ceratosaurus. Which means we only have one left. We got a Proceratosaurus going up against an Indoraptor. Probably not the smartest... Yeah, not the smartest idea out there. I figured not... We've got Greg going up against another Sukumimus. We'll see if he does. Yep. Something's holding up the traffic. We've got another car that just flung in the air from a... <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, this place cleared out pretty quickly. We don't have that many dinosaurs left. That's awesome, I guess. I mean, we still got the Spinosaurus. We've still got the Acro still alive. We've still got both Gigas. We've still got both Tarbos. Do we have any Karchas? No, both Karchas are still alive. All right, I think this is a good place to wrap up the video. If you guys enjoyed this series, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. Join me again next time where we try to build a herbivore-only sanctuary. 
and wait till the end for a surprise. But until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.